coming in and speaking no great worries. talking to you. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. Now, for those of you that don't know, base jumping is one of the most extreme sports in the entire world. So dangerous, in fact, it's been banned in many countries, including the US, where it all started. Surprise, surprise. Joining me now is Gary Connery, one of the UK's few base jumpers. Don't seem to be too many of you about. Uh, what exactly is base jumping? OK, base jumping is uh, jumping off static objects with a parachute. Base being an acronym for building, antenna, span being bridges, and, and earth. Simple as that? Yeah. But you did it with a bike. Your most sort of dangerous stunt was going off Beachy Head in Sussex with a bike and a parachute. That's right, OK, yeah. let's take a look at you doing your thang. So two words spring to mind when watching this. One is wow and the other is why. Never an easy question to answer. Um, it, it gives me a feeling that nothing else can. Um, but why I attempt this particular stunt? Just because yeah. it's never been done before? Yeah, I guess so. Um, basically, the idea was kind of... Uh, or a seed was planted after jumping off the Eiffel Tower. Um, I went down there with, with a couple of friends of mine, a guy called Dave Spurdens, who's a photographer, and, uh, and a, a writer called Ian Stafford, and, and they're working for Adrenaline magazine, and they basically said, look, we'll sponsor um, another jump, come up with an idea. And the BMX so, off the cliff. Sure. We've it's... all thought about it. We've all thought about it. But the Eiffel Tower one went horribly wrong. You obviously couldn't be bothered to queue for the lift. And, <laughs> and you were badly injured, weren't you? Yeah, I, um, I unfortunately spent seven days in, in intensive care. So how dangerous is it? I mean, why did it go wrong? Obviously, you've got a plan for these things. Yeah, um, we went down there. The tickets had been bought. I didn't want to miss the opportunity of jumping the Eiffel Tower, you know, because it's only been done by... Yeah. You can count the number of people. I'm doing it there. next Tuesday. Yeah. You're right, sure. Uh, so, so what happened? The it was too, the wrong yeah, way. it was too windy. Um, basically, I shouldn't have jumped, but I didn't want to miss the opportunity, you know. But did you know you shouldn't have jumped? You shouldn't ask me that question. What do your friends and family think? Um, you'd have to ask them that. Um, do, they, do, they, do they mind? My partner, Vivian, um, I was base jumping when I met her. Fair enough. I mean, um, we're looking at the bike here. I mean, that's, that's badly damaged. Sure. Well, that, that didn't that have could a parachute. Be you. I mean, that ain't going to get through its MOT, is it? Look at that. No, it's not. Um, well, that, that's part of the stunt. I mean, the idea was to go off the cliff using a different method other than just jumping. But really? when, you, when you look at the wheel, do you not think, oh, I've got to give this up, this is far too dangerous? Or does that make you think, wow, that was just so much fun? Um, no, to be honest, I don't really pay too much attention to the bike. Um, I'm keeping it as a souvenir, but, uh, but that's, that's <laughs> On the wall. my own glory, I Are suppose. there many casualties from base jumping? Is it, you know, because it's not, it's not actually illegal, but it's kind of frowned upon, isn't it? Um, yeah, there's, there's actually nothing that they can get you for. Um, right. In terms of breaking the law, unless I cause injury to somebody else or. But has anybody died? Damage. Any base jumper actually not got up again? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Um, but then it happens, you know, I don't think uh, the whole philosophy comes into it. I mean, I don't think people provoke death in what they do. You know, people go through two world wars and then they sit in their back garden and die of a bee sting. Fair enough. You know, so. Very quickly, now you've done this stunt, what's next? I mean, do you have something else even better than this? Um, I don't know as it's going to be. As extreme or more yeah. extreme, it's just a, a kind of a variation. Basically, I want to go off a, a bridge on a motorbike. Oh, right. Well, it is the natural <laughs> choice, I suppose. Gary, thank you very much for joining us. I wish you the best of luck with that particular stunt. I hope the bike ends up in better condition than this particular one. That thank is you. not for me. Not for me either. No, Don't I just blame look you. stupid. I'm not really stupid. Anyway, <laughs> that's just about all we've got time for this week. But do join us again next week when we've got a man who spends more time in a cave than a bat. We've got a woman who likes to give men a helping hand. Uh -huh. And we've got a geezer who does it like a girl. See you next week. Bye-bye.